welcome back to my channel again how was your christmas party hope everybody enjoyed their christmas party and the holiday and our year is going to be finished new year is coming 2019 and we're going to welcome our year with a new resolution new target i have some resolution too i will come up with that one on my next video today's makeup i came up with for any new year party you can wear it's so easy like i'm not a makeup artist or makeup professional so if i can do it you can do it as well makeup is just all about playing around with all your makeups and just paint your face sorry if i said something uh, wrong about the makeup because some makeup artists can say no you cannot just play with your makeup on your face whatever you want girl but according to me i'm an individual person and i believe you can do with your face with your body whatever you want as long as you love yourself i'm not going to make it too lengthy i will just wish you all a merry christmas belated and a happy new year to start my makeup tutorial for today if there is any mistake please forgive me as i'm not a professional makeup artist i've tried my best like other normal girls i don't like makeup i just love makeup but i cannot do it i'm just trying like other girls so please do accept my apology and with that let's start hello so i have bare face i'm going to prime my face I'm using uh, the primer from a collection which actually I really like it doesn't make my skin oily and it gives me a very nice um, smooth setup before I start doing my makeup so I will just mix it thoroughly so I will just zoom the camera a little bit using the revolution concealer and define uh, make sure that I'm not using too much um, products just in the beginning as everybody says you can use as you need but there's no point using too much product on you and then you cannot actually remove it and I will take this color to just set the concealer as it's going to be newer makeup I don't know which color to go for for eyes. I'm going to use today from revolution this uh, eye palette called Sofix revolution and it's extra spice this one I'm going to use for first time and this is how it looks like all the colors I'll start doing uh, with this brush which is the blendable fluffy brush I will just take this yellow one first I will take definitely a little amount to start with I'm going to take uh, this color and then just blend in this corner I'll be taking this brush now. I'll dare to take that 21, which is this one in here. Take a little bit to do my this corner and just blend these two. I'm going to use actually the mold wine from this palette. As I want a little bit darker, I'm just going to I just check the mold wine one, and then I'll just blend it all over on my crease line. I will take the enchanted this color in here. Just 
blend it through again. I'm going to use the same concealer here. I will actually take put it into this middle of my eyes. And it's going really well. Twenty one, and then just use it in this corner, an enchanted one. Put it in this corner and try to just blend it with this silver one. I'll take the blending brush again <laughs> just gently to blend this part which I used just now I'm going to use this flat brush again just tap it into I'll just do my eyelash on off screen and then come back so I'm back with my eyelash on and I will just take the, uh, uh, this brush again, the flat skinny one and I'll just highlight my crease area a little bit. This color from here, this corner which is called Everyday, a little bit. Just mix this again, not to leave any harsh line. As I told you before as well, I like eyebrow pencil more than other stuff to draw it and then I fill up with any eyeshadow or which goes. I'll use the brush in the corner. I cannot do eyebrow like other people, like so precise. To fill this up, I'll just use a shape and define eyebrow kit from New Look, but I don't really shape with this one. What I will do is just there is a um, I will take this this color actually to it's a powder to fill up in the middle part. But I believe as I have a cut on this eyebrow and I need to fill that up separately. I'll start with foundation. And I'm going to use today Revolution Conceal and Define and it's on shade 10.5. I'm going to use this for first time so I'm going to use just a little amount of product and just slowly slowly I will add up if I need more. And let's see what's the difference. Oh actually it really goes well with the beauty blender. Normally I do foundation first and then I do makeup, but today I thought of just giving it a go, just to use, and it's real, I'm using, I'm doing this thing for first time today, and it's really tough, once you have the eye done, and after that doing your face, is actually, you need to be careful uh, near your eye area. As well to make sure I don't look different on my face and different color on my neck. I'm going to use the concealer. Uh, it's on shade 10.5 as well. We'll take a little amount of banana powder you can use this little brush here you 
you must be thinking why I'm not contouring my face now. This is the time to do contouring and this is one of my favorite, favorite brush. This one here. Now we're talking. Uh, this is one of my favorite palette where I'm going to use this white one to do my highlighters. This is the time for the lipstick. I'll be using this mascara here. It's from Warlock and this is on eight. I'll be using this one. This is from Smith's and Colt on the shade uh, Fade the Sun. everybody for watching the video and staying with me hope everybody's gonna have a great great very beautiful very happy new year wish you all all the best and please if you like this video like it subscribe it share it i love you all and hope to see you all again bye